What is going on guys and today I'm bringing you a brand new video make sure to drop a like down below and of course Subscribe if you are new. We're still doing the million coins giveaway It's gonna run till next Friday So not this Friday coming the one after so you got about 10 days to enter and all you got to do for that is follow my twitch Instagram Twitter and of course subscribe subscribe here on YouTube Then just pop me a DM with some proof of that and I'll add you to the list and then there'll be randomizer to pick who wins but let's get into it we've got some trading methods today to make you a ton of coins we're looking at some players who will be in the league one tops in the next few days so make sure to do these methods as soon as you see the video without further ado let's get into it so guys today we have a sponsor and that is fifa exchange they are a really reliable and cheap coin site so you can get your xbox and ps4 coins for fifa 20 or when it comes out fifa 21 they will be rolling over so they're going to be reliable this year and next so make sure to go check them out the link is in the description and a massive shout out to them for supporting us so guys we are going to be looking at a few players who i have on my phone who i believe will be in the league one tops now i've done this based on stats and also based on partially who ea will go for in terms of selling packs obviously ben yenda Mbappe and Neymar are a given and we won't be investing in them or you looking at them today all of these methods are investments slash sniper filters so you can keep them for a week or you can invest in them and just quickly sell them quickly sort of later on tonight now that'll make you sort of two three hundred coins per card if you wait and hold them you're looking at maybe a k 2k per card depending on who we're looking at so first of all a very very obvious one we've got Cyprian uh, and then we've also got Di Maria. So we'll go for them two first. So Cyprian here. Uh, and then we're going to look at Di Maria. So obviously we're just going to try and get a decent snipe. Now I don't believe this guy is too expensive at the minute. He's an 80, uh, 77. So absolutely really low there. Now he may have been invested in already a little bit. But not to the extent where it's no longer possible to do the investment. You can see there a ton with one minute left at 1.7. So 1.6 is his cheapest it looks like uh, and we can probably pick one up uh, quite low under that so we're going to go for one per player in this method so 1.6 if you pick it up at 1.4 you can sell it now and make profit or you can hold it for a week and probably sell it for about two and a half k uh, so that's because of sbcs people buying it for teams any reason uh, and the fact that he'll be out of packs for seven days so that's the same for all of these players now if we can't grab one like this we'll pop on and do a compare price and see if we can grab one that way uh, there you go so there is some being listed it's just they're not being listed at 1.6 uh, or below right now so we'll just wait until one is and then we'll go for the other players obviously the idea if you're investing you want to be picking up sort of 510 if you're just sniping one or two is perfectly fine it does look like he is not being listed at all right now so we're just going to have to probably wait it out and go as quickly as possible on the sniping okay so nothing there at 1.5 is he being listed at all uh, we'll see if we can get a snipe like that and then if not you know if it takes us too long we can obviously move on but he is definitely an investment worth looking into i'm just sniping at kind of like one of them odd times that isn't always best but we got 1.3 there very nice so that's the first one we can whack him on the transfer list and then we're going to have a look at the next player of course got it on my phone as usual we will be looking as i said at before at Di maria now we're not going to look at too many of the psg players obviously the vast majority of them are going to be more expensive uh, than what your average investor or average trader at the minute is looking to spend we're just going to see first of all how much Di maria is obviously neymar and bape if you've got the coins give it a go it's not a bad investment but i'm not going to advise everyone to do it because it definitely isn't going to be an easy one uh, we've got 20k here is roughly what he's going for ea tax will be 1k so 18750 and under obviously you just want to get as low as you can if you can get a de maria for like 10k absolutely solid you're going to be able to sell that up for way more in a couple of days time uh i mean mbappe as well neymar you've got those two i'm trying to think if there's any other sort of big hitters in that league i guess navas maybe or Verratti. Um, but personally, I don't think they're that expensive. So you guys could just invest in them now. Um, obviously, we're going to have to wait a little bit longer to get a Di Maria because you always do when there's a more expensive player. But the profit is going to be a lot more. Uh, I think Di Maria might be more of an SPC base rather than uh, people using them for teams or anything. Uh, let's have a look if any have been taken off the market. 19750. Okay, so the 19750s are going. Uh, but 
Oh, the twenties are as well. So we might have actually got a bit under what it is. Right, twenty-one there, twenty-five hundred. What's that? At? Okay, twenty-five hundred. Right, so it looks like 19.5 actually might be more of a realistic place to be sniping them at, which definitely isn't uh, a bad place to be honest. Let's have a look. We'll go 20, see if we can do a little bit of compare pricing. Obviously, I am sniping, as I said, at a weird time. Nine o'clock really isn't exactly prime time. There's no lightning rounds, no SPCs or anything. I'm just doing it, obviously, because I tend to play or uh, we'll go on here a little bit later. So if you don't think I'm getting many cards, it's because I'm not, but don't let that discourage you. It's not because the method doesn't work. It's more because I am too lazy to get up any earlier. So it's more of a me thing. Um, we're going to try and get one of these. I might have to speed it up a little bit, uh, but hopefully when I come back, I will have a Di Maria for a very good pro. Oh my God, we've just... After getting kicked out of... EA and coming back onto the game, we've just got one. I even took my hat off. We spent ages waiting for that, and we've just got like the bare minimum for a snipe. Um, I'm personally, you know, what? I'm gonna hold it because I was gonna sell him. I'm not needing investments too much, but you know what? We'll hold him uh, and we'll hope he bring hope. Uh, hope he brings us some more coins, which I'll probably end up giving away to you guys because I'm not playing at the minute. We're gonna go for Atal next. It looks like he's had a little bit of a price up. I think people are realizing a lot of these players are going to get some fairly good cards coming in. 2.2 there, straight off the bat of Snipe. We might actually, I mean, I could take that, to be honest, and just be happy with it. But what we'll do is we'll go for one more. Obviously, that was pretty easy. Uh, I wouldn't even say we had to try for that Snipe. He's, he's going for about 2.5, so we've got him fairly bit under. Uh, we're looking at 2.3 as like the minimum to pick him up, to be honest. Let's see if we can grab maybe a 2.1 or a 1.5. It does seem like the market is really dry now. I don't know if that is just because of the time I'm doing it. Maybe FIFA has fell off more than I thought it had. Um, I definitely thought it had a few more weeks in it. But, you know, I mean, a lot of you guys still watch the videos. So I guess that's probably true. But it's pretty mad how little these guys are being listed. I guess a lot of people have already invested. Or a lot of people will pack him and think he's in team of the season next week. I know who that is. I'm not going to sell him. Um, well, hopefully, we can grab another one, I'll say. We'll do a little bit more on him. It does seem a bit mental that he's not coming up as it is. Uh, this is the same with Di Maria. I don't, you know, these guys are probably being heavily invested into at this point. Um, or they're just not being listed up. Or there's no packs. You know, it's, I don't think I'm late to it. Because I think a lot of people are late investing in these. But I guess people who have had more of an opportunity may have uh, taken up a lot of the market, I guess. Um, we're going to go for a little bit of a speed run, see if we can get it, and I will come back to you when we do. Oh my god, we bought the 2.4 off the market to get rid of like the remaining stock so that people would maybe list him less. And it worked. And he straight away went for 2k. I don't know why I still got my hat off because the hair is in the gulag. The trim is definitely in the gulag. Um, we are going to need... You know what? We're going to go for the final player. I mean, I spent a while on him to get to, but we'll, we'll go for the final one. Uh, and we are going for, if I do remember rightly... Higher. And if we don't get him quickly, I am going to be vexed. I'm not going to be happy. Because that has taken us too long to go for those two. There you go. He's cheap. This is going to be a lot easier. Finally, an easy investment. 1.7, 1.8 there. Two minutes as well. I'd say 1.7. I mean, I'm trying to think how quickly are these guys going. 1.5. Brilliant. Right. Call it a day there. Because the other guys finessed us. We are not being finessed anymore. All right, that was unintentional. What have I done there? Got my towels up. That's all for you today. I'll see you guys tomorrow.